Hi, this is Jackie from the Builderall team. In this tutorial, I'm going to show you how to create an email sequence in Mailing Boss. Now, right here on the left hand side, if you scroll down in Mailing Boss up to Campaigns, you're going to see the third option from the top is Email Sequence. So you're going to click on Email Sequence. And then you're going to see right here at the top, it says Create Sequence. We're going to click on that. And we're going to give the sequence a name. And I'm just going to say Team Matrix Newsletter. And then I'm going to choose the list that I want to work with. And then I'm going to click Add Campaign. And then we're going to make sure that I'm choosing Newsletter. And then there's a little pencil right there. And then you're going to choose the type. Is it a regular email? Is it the autoresponder, which is going to be in this case, or automation? So we're going to keep it on autoresponder. And then there, we don't have an existing sequence, so nothing will be available right there. And we're going to click Save. Now this app is going to open up, and this is where we're going to put in the email details. So we can write your weekly newsletter. And we're going to give it some text. Hi, and I'm just going to type a lot of nonsense there. And you would be able to add additional different kind of things in. You can add a heading into it. You can have images added to it. You can even have a button added. So there's a lot of different kinds of things that you can beautify the email sequence that you're going to send out on the left hand side. And you would also be able to add layout options here and change the look and feel of the email. So once you've done and designed everything, you're just going to click on save. Just put on your send the email first. Send the email and your reply. And then you're going to click save. And now you need to choose the event details. After subscribe, how long do you want to wait? Or is it per weekday? So after subscribe, you can say immediately. So you're not going to wait any days. It's going to be immediately or you can even put in minutes. So wait five minutes before this email is going to be sent out at the same subscription time. The activation time. Send to existing subscribers or to new. So you can just leave it like that if you want to. And you can do a test email there. So once you fill out all that information, you can click Save and Activate. But in this case, I'm just going to click Save. And I'm going to click Save again. So now you can see if we go and edit this existing campaign, you're going to see we only have one sequence. If you want to add another one to the sequence, this is going to click on Add Campaign. And we're going to go through the same process. We're going to put our details in everywhere that we need to. We're going to click Save. And we're going to add second newsletter. And I'm just going to put a lot of words here so that we can go through it quickly. I'm just going to do that. And then I'm going to put my sender email. That's wrong. And I'm going to click Save. And then I'm going to say after subscribe. I'm going to wait three days. And I'm going to save. I'm not going to activate it because I'm still creating my list. So you can see my sequence has been changed here. It's all under the same sequence, which is the Team Matrix newsletter. And that would be the first one, zero days, three days. And you can keep adding the sequences as you wish. And that is basically how you would add a sequence in Mailing Boss. I hope you enjoyed this tutorial and I'll see you in another.